We are looking at a superstar, Gus. It's me and you and your mom. Good to have you with us. You look great. Okay. So Aaron, tell us about your son. Gus is special in the fact that he, at the age of almost two, he was almost two when he was diagnosed with medulloblastoma, which is a form of pediatric brain cancer. They found a golf ball sized tumor in the back of his brain and we had to have major brain surgery and within five days of discovering the tumor, they removed 99% of it. Um, and unfortunately, um, upon discovery, they found out that there were little tumors scattered throughout his brain. Since then, he's been on what's called maintenance chemotherapy, which is just a lower dosage. Um, but you wouldn't tell by looking at him that he's on anything. What does it mean to see a school come behind your son and help support him? Anytime a, a little kid comes and embraces Gus and his cause, it's just incredible to me and it really just warms my heart um, because they really, I mean, they don't, they're off in their own little world most of the time and for a little one to embrace Gus is just so, it's so special. And the whole school is even more incredible. We're about to meet one of the young kids that's donated his time to help Gus's cause. Jack, give me a high five. First and foremost, did you know that your hair is green? Yes, sir. And why is it green? Because I want to just put awareness of St. Baldrick's and Gus and all the other kids that have cancer. Well, Gus is one cool dude. We just saw him, but why are you raising money for Gus? because I care about him and he's a great kid and he has cancer so, and we do not know what it's like to have cancer. But tell us why we should all give back. Because everybody matters and God cares for us because he made us and it, it gives them hope because they will get to live if everybody helps. And you're doing a great job making that happen. Jack, my main man with the green hair. I love it. First and foremost, Christian, tell us about the challenge that you conquered. It was kind of hard because you know, I didn't feel good when I found out I had a had cancer. And when you heard you had cancer, what did you think? I wasn't sure I was gonna, if I was going to live or die. That had to be so scary. What kept you strong? God. Really? Mm -hmm. You prayed a lot? Oh yeah. So Christian, you're awesome, but now, now that you're strong again, it's important for you to raise money to help kids. Why is that? I want to raise money for kids to beat cancer. You're doing a great job. Now tell us about the goal you just reached and what happened once the goal is reached. Our goal was to raise 5000 by March 9th. And if we raise 5000 my mom will shave her head. Oh, did she think you would be able to raise $5,000? Well, let's get mom in here so we can see what she's like with hair. So Christian, now that you see your mom here, what do you think she's going to look like with no hair? Um, she's not going to look pretty anymore. <laughs> but it's for a good cause, right? Yes. It's okay. It's worth it. Well, God answered your prayers. You've done a great job, and thanks for being such an inspiration. And I can't wait to see your mom bald, huh? That's mm -hmm. going to be awesome. So glad you got to check out that clip. But listen, we've got plenty more going on here at Get Connected, our TV show. My friend and I are going to give you a glimpse of all the fun. So take it away. The sun shines bright as it moves across my face. I feel the light and everything is in its place. Ooh. I woke up feeling great. Ooh. Today was made for me. Life is good the way it should, the way it was meant to be. Well, join us and we'll get you in the know. Check us out at Get Connected at ConTV.com and be part of the movement. It's a beautiful day.